Like, what they would have to do, to, I was talking to my buddy the other day, like, what they would have to do to get me to stop watching. Because you, know, like, you love football. You yeah, watch football. Yeah, the, the commissioner could literally punt a baby across his <laughs> office <laughs> with his wingtips on. I'm still going to watch on Sunday. I don't condone the man's actions, <laughs> but it's football. This, I don't like how they interview the coaches, too, when they go to the half, like, in, in halftime. Yeah. As they're running off. They shouldn't have to talk to somebody in, like, a ski parker. You're not even in football. Yeah. If, did you even play to the high school level? No, no, probably you not. You took journalism. Yeah. Get out of here. What about... <laughs> yeah, it's a bunch of nerds interrupting people who know what they're doing. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> They literally blame guys that she was a serial killer. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, when you saw the Jeffrey Dahmer movie, it wasn't like, ah, somebody shoved a tuna fish sandwich up my ass, and I confused people with food, so I... Like, they didn't make, like, a big excuse for him. You know? She was a psycho killing people, and she should have died. But I'm, like, watching it feeling guilt. Do they ever take responsibility for their act? Didn't she, for the first five years, have, like, midgets who wanted to bang their mailman's boyfriend? And she, and she didn't want to do it. But she stood on the heads of those little people for five years until she got... And then she, she's sitting there across from this guy, like, like, so how could you... You know exactly what he's doing. It's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Oh, Get your seat, and you'd sit there, and they're about ready to close the door, and you'd have that empty seat next to you. Like, yes, like yes. the poor man's first class. You're like, oh, shit, I'll bring the armrest up. I can actually just be great. And then all of a sudden, some fat bastard gets on the platform, <laughs> and you're like, no, no, no. You're, you're literally, you're like Quint at the end of Jaws, like sliding down the floor. <laughs> There are women that wait, that wait, uh, waited 22 days at Best Buy. They waited 22 days. And what did they get? What, did, what do you think they got? I don't do, know. Do you I... think they got trampled. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, if you're gonna go there, so, yeah. yeah, you don't get trampled grabbing your wig, you know? <laughs> the suspenders flying off. It's so sad. To do what? Get an above ground pool for $30 off? <laughs> <laughs> this, there is nothing, there is nothing in Walmart worth getting trampled over. Abandoned. There's nothing. It's, it's cross it, hop out of the line and you wait till that first wave or two falls down and then you go over the top like Walter Payton back in the day. Go out of it. But even then, even then, you gotta know where to go in the store. Like, where is the thing that is on sale, right? Where are those Mint Milano cookies or whatever they have that you're gonna make a beeline for? We had all these waffles, eggs, bacon, this whole layout. My brother was looking at half-eaten cube steaks. So he looked at my mom, he goes, Mom, can I have a waffle? She goes, no, that is your breakfast. And he goes, oh, Mom, I hate you. And my dad, without looking up, took a full glass of milk and threw it in his face. <laughs> <laughs> Swear to God. This is what kills me. What kills You're worried about this environmental stuff. You really are worried about it. Uh, I am and I'm not. I just also feel like, you know, it'd probably be a good thing if most of us died. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? It would be. You know how I would do it? What? I would, I would randomly sink cruise ships. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What? Why would you randomly sink cruise ships? Because <laughs> you, you'd get like 2,500 to 3,000 people a whack, right? And I don't think... I think it's a good mix of people to get rid of. <laughs> to be they, yeah, they're, the not, they're not interested. What happens when Bruce became Caitlyn? That was like a national news story. Dude, you shave your beard off. People were like, oh my God, that's your chin? Wow. <laughs> this guy walked out, a dude came back, a woman. You're just supposed to be like, oh yes, anyways, Caitlyn, that's all I was saying. <laughs> you know, this, this, I miss that guy. I miss him already. <laughs> He should have told us. He should have given us a chance to say goodbye. I love, you know, I watched him on the Olympics. Uh -huh. I watched him on Chips. I watched him on that horrible show my wife watched where he just walks around in the background. <laughs> and it's just like... 
holding up a sign of somebody that they either know that's dying of cancer or died of it in the middle of the game. I'm trying to watch a game here. You know, no, there's a time and a place. Look, I know somebody. I know somebody that has died of cancer. I would never go to the movies with you and in the middle of it hit pause and be like, oh, by the way, Conan, I know this guy. <laughs> he died of cancer, it was horrific. I could have lifted 